All right, let's start playoff match number three. Drivers behind the line. Three, two, one, go. Welcome to playoff match three here at Boiler Bob Battle Fields. Now extra reinforced. I'm ready for the extra brutal uh, things that will happen during these playoff matches. Red Alliance successfully departing their taped off area, scoring those movement points. 234 sitting high and proud. 8096 able to successfully deliver a couple of those game pieces. Both looking pretty tight here at the moment at Boiler Bot Battle. 30 to 36 with over two minutes remaining in the match. 234 still sitting pretty on top of that charge station. They're looking to potentially move off here in a few minutes. 39 and 40 using the charge station as a ramp to quickly move around. Easy to see with that lighting bar giving active feedback to their human controllers on what just happened with their robot. 1741, that's red alert, quickly delivering a cone to the top part of the grid area. Area. 234 and their alliance partners are tit for tat inside of their human player station area. They need to make sure to share the game pieces that come out of that to maximize the amount of points that can get during the game. Both teams are able to place cones, a strategic decision probably made during alliance selection to maximize the amount of game pieces and points that are available for their team to place. 3490. 3940, I should say, that's Cybertooth ramming against the far side of the wall, but able to quickly deliver that cone potentially to the second part of the grid, scoring three points for Alliance. They are successful, which is great to see. 70 seconds remaining in our match. Checking in with the blue Red Alliance team, I should say. 234, that's Cyber Blue after successfully delivering a cone to the top part of their grid quickly yeet themselves over and look to check out the human player station. We've now exhausted all those game pieces that started on the field. So the only way to get more in is to go visit your human player and get them at the human player station and cargo recipient area. 4485, uh, doing, playing a little bit of defense on 1741. They have to make sure to keep that contact to a minimum. Only so much time before you can be considered pinning. Our refs are keeping a close eye during this competition. Still amazed by the roughness that you can play with with Cyber 3940's robot. As we move into endgame, robots will start considering moving towards that charge station to get extra points for being level. Each robot up there that is level, I believe, is 10 points for their alliance. I should check on that for sure. Uh, but we just have 11 seconds remaining in the match. Blue Alliance a little bit stuck. They have a few moments remaining. We'll just see how these scores shake out. That was the end of playoff match three. Here are your scores for playoff match three. Your winners are the Blue Alliance. The Blue Alliance, that's Alliance seven, will advance. We'll see them next in match eight, remaining in the upper bracket. Alliance two, losing this match, not quite out yet. We'll see them next at match six in the lower bracket. Stay tuned for more at Boiler Bot Battle.